This song, come on, let me see you get gone. Get gone. Baby mamas, this <sighs> your song. Hey, what is up, my beauties, and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Silver Monique. And for today's video, as you guys already know, we are going to be doing an update on my pregnancy. Y'all see it? Look at my stomach. I think she has dropped some, but I got a week left, so. I'm super excited but nervous. I'm like feeling all the emotions right now. Not only will I be giving you guys an update on my pregnancy and how everything has been going so far and with me only having a week left, but I will also be showing you guys these welcome kits that I have received from both Amazon and Target. So if you are pregnant or if you plan on getting pregnant and you plan on like having a baby shower or just making a registry, you will get a welcome kit, a free welcome kit from both Target and Amazon or I believe whichever like site that you plan on like creating a registry with, they do have welcome kits for all of them. Cause I've seen other sites that I was gonna do a registry with, but I was like, mm, I just I just didn't want to do too many. And so I was just like, I'm gonna just stick with Amazon and Target. Everybody loves Target and everybody loves Amazon like find everything on Amazon and so I have all my baby stuff right here I'm going to organize that stuff later maybe I'll do another video on that but so far I think I'm just going to go ahead and start with these welcome kits that I got from both Target and Amazon so I took everything out of the, the Amazon registry already and so I'm just going to show you guys what comes in each so I took everything out already but I have it right here so I'm just show you guys what all came with it so it came with a Phillips bottle. Now this bottle goes up to four ounces, so it's a small one. And then it came with some CeraVe moisturizing lotion as well as some wash and shampoo. So these little bottles, these are like testers or whatever. That's what I think they are. Like everything that came in, these welcome kits are all like testers because it comes with just tiny portions. And then I got this. These are prenatal vitamins. I actually have a whole bottle of these prenatal vitamins in my room right now. And then it came with two packs of these water wipes. And then it came with some swash laundry detergent. And then it also comes with, so these, I plan on breastfeeding, so these are storage bags for my breast milk. And I can put it in the freezer, I can store the breast milk in here, put it in the freezer or the fridge. Then it also came with like some nursing pads. So, one for each boob. And that's pretty much, I believe, that's it that came within the Amazon welcome kit for your baby registry. Wait, matter of fact, I think it came with one more thing. I feel like I might be missing something like some pampers or something. Mm. Oh, it also came with this. It came with a onesie. That's what I'm missing. It came with a onesie. So this is unisex. All right, you guys. So now we're going to go ahead and take a look at the Target welcome kit. And so they kind of went crazy. But it came with a pack of Huggies, diapers and came with three in this one little pack and it's a it's a size one it came with these luxury diapers as well and it's a two pack and it's a size one as well so these luxury diapers i can't wait to try them out i might actually go buy a big pack of these came with some wipes from the honest brand it came with some wipes from the huggies brand but these are a natural care sensitive wipes and then it also came with these water wipes that, these are the same ones that I got from Amazon as well. So it came with these water wipes too. One pack of those. And then it also comes with two breast milk storage bags and disposable nursing pads, just like Amazon. And then it comes with a Dr. Brown's baby bottle. I got two baby bottles, one from each. It comes with some Aveeno, a small bottle of Aveeno B 
baby wash and shampoo. Albino is always good. I actually have a lot of this. And then it comes with some lotion for myself and my stretch marks. This actually was using some of this early on in my pregnancy. It comes with some boogie wipes for the baby. And then it also comes with some detergent. Small sample package. And then it comes with grip water, a package of grip water, which I've never heard of this, but I believe it's for the baby. So it says it relieves occasional stomach discomfort from gas, colic, fussiness, and hiccups. And that's it. So that's all that came within the Target. Welcome kit. Target definitely had more than what Amazon had. But all of this stuff is free. So I appreciate anything that's free. So make sure y'all go ahead and go get y'all um, some free stuff. If you never use something, it's a good way to see if you like it or not. And um, if you want to go out and buy it and continue using it. So they have a bunch of things for you to just test out. So I like that. I didn't do this with my friends because I didn't know. And I don't think anybody that I know did this. But hey, it's free. So why not? That's that. Now let's get into this pregnancy update. Your girl is 38 weeks. Ah, oh my gosh. 38 weeks. I'm going to be 39 weeks in two days as of this video. I'm going to go ahead and go to the what to expect app that I'm pulling up on my phone, you guys. Um, Y'all know the deal. So, like I said, as of today, I have 38 weeks and five days. Silver's baby is as big as a mini watermelon. Oh my gosh. Let's see. What y'all think? OMG. So, I have, it says I have two weeks to go because I got to finish out this week. And I'll be 39 weeks on Wednesday in two days. And then next week I gotta be ready. So the what to expect app gives me tips as well. So it's telling me to do squat exercises. Ever heard of women of your squatting wherever they happen, happen to be to give birth? Well, it turns out there's something to it. Squatting actually speeds labor because it increases the pelvic opening, providing more room for a baby to descend. Don't worry, this isn't to suggest that you take to the fields when those contractions start coming, but start working squats into your workout routine now so you'll be a stronger squatter when the time comes in the hospital or birthing center, that is. I'm about to be doing squats all week, okay? Baby gotta come on time. So, what to expect or what are some common symptoms? More frequent urination, yes, mucus plug, you may be experiencing more discharge now and you may even pass a mucus plug, a clear yellow or brown glob of mucus that's been working your cervix throughout your pregnancy. As you become dilated, does this mean that labor is imminent? Maybe, but it could be days or even weeks away. Haven't seen a, my mucus plug yet, so that's nothing new. Um, bloody show, but vaginal discharge can be Tinge pink or brown as the blood vessels in the cervix rupture during dilation and effacement. Don't come for me. Uh, once your underwear or toilet paper has the hint of color, it could mean you'll be face to face with your baby sooner rather than later. No, not experiencing that yet, you guys. Diarrhea, haven't been, mm. <laughs> No, like last week I swear I was going to the bathroom a little bit too much. Itchy belly, one way to soothe an itchy belly, slather on vitamin E oil, so that's nothing new. Um, my belly, yes, it's, it's still be itchy, but I try to keep it moisturized as much as possible. And it says, in fact, you might want to stock up on an extra bottle of vitamin E capsules. It's also great for sore nipples, which are in your near future if you're planning to breastfeed. What? I didn't know that. Be sure to check with your doctor before taking extra vitamin E, though. Okay. Definitely gonna check with my doctor. I have an appointment, doctor's appointment tomorrow. Edema, swelling, and feet and ankles. No, no swollen feet and ankles over here, okay? 
insomnia your mind is racing so much you can't sleep don't turn on the computer to search for info on labor and delivery that will just keep you up longer when you do go to bed instead grab something low tech a book or a magazine and read for a bit that will soothe you to sleep faster hmm i have been experiencing some insomnia not even gonna lie I don't know my mind do be raised it's just be so much going on up here like just too much sometimes nesting instinct a charge of energy level is pretty common this week you may be increasingly exhausted or you may get a burst of energy also known as a nesting instinct yeah we talked about this last time um but let me continue reading go ahead and clean but don't wear yourself out save that energy for childbirth instead of squandering it on a clean closet I've been trying to get organized. I've been trying to clean. I've been trying to do everything before this baby come. Like, just trying to prepare as much as possible. Because I know I won't have the same amount of support that I did with my first. So, I might. I might. I don't know. But, you know, you just want to be prepared anyway. So, that's what I'm doing. Um, leaky breasts. Your breasts may be bigger than they've ever been. Though, they'll grow even more. And leaking colostrum. If they're not, uh, if they're not though, don't worry. Neither is a sign that you'll have difficulty breastfeeding if that's what you plan to do. I don't want my boobs to get no bigger. I really don't like. They already big enough. Y'all see, like, they big, they huge. Because right now your girl weigh 180 pounds and it didn't go nowhere but right here and right here. Cause I ain't get no thighs. I ain't, it didn't go to my arms. And go to my face, like, yeah. But lastly, it says Bra Braxton Hicks contractions. Haven't been experiencing no Braxton Hicks contractions either. So these practice contractions may be getting more intense now. This is a good time to go over your breathing and visualization techniques. If your partner is around, do them together. Haven't been experiencing that. But it then it gives me recommended products that I need for, it says best postpartum pads. I really like using 100% uh, cotton pads or organic. So these ones right here, y'all will see on the, on the screen. So I'm gonna try those out. Never tried that brand before, I don't think. But I got my breast pump, you guys. So um, depending on your insurance, they will give you one for free. If you don't have insurance, make sure you get insurance so that you can get a free breast pump. And so I got a free breast pump, and that's one where I have to plug into the wall and everything like that, which is cool. And maybe I'll show you guys that um, in a different video. But I also got a um, electrical breast pump that's a cordless you know breast pump where I don't have to be sitting down actually I got that as a, a baby shower gift and so um, I'm excited to use that well the person who ordered it for me got the wrong size and so I had to return it to get the right size because these boobs is too big I'm the biggest one the biggest one okay so I had to return that one and get the one that I know is gonna fit for sure okay and it's not gonna be the smallest size it's gonna be the biggest size okay so that's that um, I'm super excited to try that out because y'all breastfeeding is no joke like it, it definitely does drain you and you just want to make sure that you have a lot of support especially with a newborn baby because it can be a lot and so um, having a breast pump where you can just put inside like your bra and still be able to get up and move and do things that you want to do you know instead of having to sit there and get even more tired and by that time you'd be ready to fall asleep because I know that was happening to me every single time and so this electrical breast pump I feel like it's just gonna save me a lot of time to actually get up and just do stuff handle things that I need to handle right, so that's pretty much it thank you guys for tuning in and I will see you all on the next video make sure you guys go ahead and like comment and subscribe to my channel and if you have any questions on anything make sure you guys go ahead and leave me a comment in the comment section below and until next time you guys I will see you all on the next video let's get a look at this tummy look at that when the song come on, let me see you get gone. Get gone. Baby mama, this your song been pregnant.